YouTubers, this is me, Will, from Simple Kid Fun, and in this video, we are going to draw a meerkat. This is actually Dusk, uh, he's actually very uh, generous, and anyway, we're going to um, draw him today. I hope you all like this video, and let's get started. Okay, so our first step to drawing our meerkat is um, to draw his eyes. They're kind of on the side of his face, and they're kind of black, beady eyes, so... We're gonna draw the first eye. We're gonna draw the second eye. So that it should look like two very small circles. And then we're gonna shade those in. Okay. Once those are shaded in, we are going to draw his head. It's a like circle, but we need to make room for like his designs on his fur. So, so we're going to, uh, Draw his head. And finish there. And then we're going to draw his mouth. But before we draw his mouth, uh, we're gonna extend his face so it looks like, it looks more three dimensional. So how we're gonna do this is we're gonna draw another circle. We actually need to extend the circle all the way around his outer eyes. So it's gonna go like this. Kind of like the monkey we did, where we made the heart shape, but the only this one isn't a heart shape. Next, we're gonna draw his um, nose. So it's gonna be a football shape. And two little holes for nostrils. And then shade that in. Okay, now that we have his eyes and his nose done, we're going to draw his mouth. It's just going to be a simple V shape. And if you want, we could add a little line to make it more like he's ready to fight anything. Okay, now we're gonna draw his ears. They're kinda on the side of his head, so we're gonna kinda do them really small. It's kinda like a Lobot from Star Wars, anyway. So that's what he should look like now. And then uh, Miracats, they have like this design on their face that's like a triangle by their eyes. So we're gonna do it on both sides, a triangle right there, and a triangle right there. And then um, we're gonna kinda color in this lightly but darkly. So you can see the eye, but like not anywhere near it. And we'll go in and improve this afterward and color this in better. And we'll do that on the other side as well. Okay, now that we have done that um, design on his head, we're going to draw his body. And his body is kind of like an interesting body. He kind of looks like perched up like this. And so that's what we're gonna draw him as. So let's finish using these eyes. And now we're going to get two lines, extend them down here like this. Okay, and then we're going, these are for his arms. So now we're gonna make a U shape on both sides. And then draw two lines on them very lightly because these are his fingers and then bring it back up to his head two lines connecting to his neck okay uh he kind of looks weird doesn't he well that's because he's missing his entire body so the first thing the next thing we're gonna do is extend his um we're going to come down here like this and get by his feet like this and bring a U in for his foot. So like that, so he's like sitting on the ground like a dog does. And then we're gonna connect it with, come with the U over here, do the same thing, two lines for his toes, and then bring it into his arm. Okay, we finished our mirror cat. Um, he also does have a tail on his back. It's gonna be kind of hard to pull that in, but 
How about we do it on the side? So he kind of looks like a fat raccoon, except with no mask. And oh, also his ears are black, so we can color in those ears right there and maybe extend them a little further out. Okay, now um, we're kinda, we're going to make him like look like he's sitting. So there's gonna be two uh, very, very light lines um, coming down right here, coming by his feet. You can actually make this one a little bigger because it looks like small. And you can do that on the other side too. So we're going to do two of those on that side. And on the other side, make it big, two toes. And then I'm gonna extend this side a little bit out so he's kind of like plumper, or fatter I should say. Okay, um, and let's get that other line from his hand coming down. Well, there's our meerkat right there, but we also forgot his patterns on him. So we're gonna come up here with a very light line, connect there, and then do the same thing on the other side. Cause he, cause he has a pattern on his chest. And even then, right here, we could extend it over to his legs and do that on the other side too. Cause that's where he's white as. And, uh, yeah, that's our mirror cat. Um, the only thing we're missing though is um, color. And you need to color this in. I'm gonna actually add a little like, or so he actually kind of looks like furry. So you can do that too. But I'm gonna do that in the video, so let me erase that. I'm gonna make him more like a mirror cat. So anyway, you can pause the video to match my same coloring at the end. But anyway, let's get coloring. Well, that's our mirror cat. I, I hope you enjoyed this lesson today. Um, I also added a few fuzziness by his ears and some stripes on him. Um, I also outlined his toes in black. And anyway, um, you can do that too, but here's my meerkat. I hope you enjoyed this uh, art lesson, my friends. Goodbye!